Welcome to Dry Rice Sports Gamer 1. I'm here with day five, 4, 5, 5, I think. Uh, no, 4. Yeah, 4 of the Saga Tuck um, trip. Right now we're in the water at Douglas Beach. And yeah, I, I read if you have a choice, Oval Beach or Douglas Beach, I would probably go to Oval. There's a lot of rocks in the sand, but other than that, uh, it's pretty it's pretty nice and awesome. I'm sorry, this will probably be a short vlog again, because, again, we're in the water, and I need to get, like, a waterproof case or a GoPro. So, yeah, this place is pretty nice. Just walking around on the really shallow part, and there's there's a, there's a lot bigger waves at, uh, at Douglas Beach than um uh, Oval Beach, but yeah, it, I, it's pretty cool. Like you sink into the sand, and yeah, uh, you you can uh, we were gonna paddleboard, and I was gonna videotape that, but there wasn't any left. Hey, my shadow! Hi. There wasn't any left. Uh, which stinks, but yeah, it's fine, I guess, because we can do that tomorrow, but yeah, we might, and sorry about the short vlog, this is really going to be short, because it's already like 2.30, and this is, I just started, so yeah, but yeah, like I said a million times, it's really, really nice here, and I might, we might go on, really small chance, we might go on that that uh chain ferry i think i can't even remember that's sad uh that we might be going on that but we probably won't and we're going to the red red dock we're gonna have to get there quick because remember like you had to be 21 and older to go on the dock after four or something so yeah we're probably gonna leave like in a little bit but yeah but there's a legendary donut i've been using this like the whole time in the football and yeah, it looks so good. Take a bite. My feet keep getting stuck in the, the wet sand. And can you hear that? They keep getting stuck and I have to pull them out. Probably isn't safe for my iPod because if my feet get stuck and then I fall down, I'll have to hold it up just like if we fell out of a kayak. And yeah, I'm going to stop because I keep slipping. I'm so done climbing up all of these stairs. It's actually pretty hard to... Uh, uh, walk. No campfires. And that stinks. Because <laughs> that would be cool to have a campfire. Almost to the top. So close. Then I'm just going to fall on the last step. <sighs> the sand makes it hard too because there's so much uh, sand. Douglas Beach. Teach me how to Douglas. Instead of Dougie. Now we have a long walk to our car all the way to the end oh no it's, i thought that you said all the way to the end i thought you meant like a long time i know but i thought you meant i thought it was longer it's a puddle there it is it's douglas beach what if that was you can have a picnic over here and there's our car and that's garbage can everyone already knew that what does that sign say what the, where'd it go oh it's up here I can hardly see it. Oh, something about dog poop. I have to put all this stuff in our trunk. And I'm gonna, I'm taking the donut. No matter what. No, I gotta, I gotta get the sand off. Oh yeah, cause there's a lot of sand. Is that your towel? Why did you bring your towel up here? There's our umbrellas. I'm gonna go, oh, I get it now. Okay, time, we can have some hot dogs over here. Oh, that looks so gross. Wobbly. You can sit here and eat a, have a picnic. I almost said eat a picnic. Whoa. This looks pretty cool. Probably can't see that good. Because I can't either. That looks cool. If that wasn't, if the fence wasn't in the way, it would be better. But of course it is. Zoom out. Because that would be weird. I walked up here. I thought it, the beach was really closed for the season. And the season would be summer, so that wouldn't make any sense. 
What if it was open in the winter and closed in the summer? That would make so much sense. Shot from at the, well, we're not at the top anymore, but that still looks nice. You're tired from walking up those stairs. God, all the You way still here. have a long way. <laughs> it's not that bad. <laughs> we just went up and down. Yeah. Because no, I'm Rai Rai Sports Gamer 1. I can climb upstairs. Hi guys, we're on the deck now. Uh, we've, we've just been waiting to go to dinner. Uh, and I don't know where we're going or anything, but I guess since we're waiting to go out to eat, I'll uh, talk about uh, the trade deadline right now. Because why not? Because uh, there's been some great moves already. My shadow again, hi. Um, I'll talk about the first one, the first, uh, big move, like, really big move, Johnny Cueto to the Royals, and I was, uh, pretty mad about that, you know, I'm a Tigers fan, I hate the Royals, and I hate Ohio State, too, I hate Ohio State more, because I'm a Michigan State fan, um, uh, go green, go white, uh, okay, I'm getting distracted, uh, and they gave up, uh, I think the, the Royals gave up a guy with the last name Finnegan, I think. Can't remember. But, yeah, I think that was a good move for the Royals. I hate to say it, but they're going to be pretty good for a couple of years. I don't want them to be. And probably the biggest deal, Troy uh, Tulowitzki for Jose Reyes. And I really don't. I kind of get the trade, I kind of don't. Good for the the Rockies. I, well, I, it doesn't really make much sense on both uh, sides. I don't get it. Well, it will make the Blue Jays a lot better, but, I mean, they're adding another bat, but he can. he's a great defender. He's the best shortstop in the league. And, um, but now they have so much power on that team. They, they're going to be good this year. Probably making the second wild card spot if Tilowitzki, uh plays like he uh, is supposed to play uh, good. Um, and they need to add a, probably another pitcher at, during the trade deadline. And that will be really good for a couple years to come or more. And, yeah, that's pretty much... Oh, wait, there's one more. The Royals got Ben Zobrist. I was mad about that, too. I'm like, geez, since when do the Royals make all these moves? But I'm I really want to see what the Tigers do on the, at the trade deadline because they have a couple more days till the trade deadline. I don't think they're gonna trade Price. I don't think they're gonna trade Cespedes. But when they get Cabrera back, they'll uh, go back to how they were playing good. And Cespedes is playing really good. Price is pitching tonight actually against the Rays. Um. And yeah, I'm excited to see what they're going to do. They'll, well, knowing Dave Dabrowski, they'll end up with like Mike Trout or something. <laughs> Probably, they, they obviously won't, but he's like that good of a, a GM. He can make those crazy moves. Like the David Price trade. Like, how did they, how did they get David Price for nothing? They probably could have got a lot uh, better, uh, players, well, wait, they, all they got was Drew Smiley, who's now hurt, and he wasn't that good with the Tigers, he had some good games, but he wasn't unbelievable or anything, and Scott Casimir went to the uh, Astros, which was a good move for them, too, and yeah, that's pretty much it, there's been a couple little moves, like Steve uh, C. Uh, uh, Shack going to the Cardinals. And yeah, that was a. Watch, he's going to pitch a lot better. I, have no, I don't know why, but Marlins are struggling, and now he's going to a, a, a World Series contender, which that. Uh, he can win a, a ring. <laughs> he's not going to do that with the Marlins for a couple of years. Well, more than a couple of years. There's so many great teams now in the MLB. But. If the Tigers want to rebuild, this is their chance right now. Because Price probably isn't coming back if they don't trade him as a free agent. They can't afford him, really. 
And now I'm seeing rumors about Ian Kinsler. He has to be like my one of my favorite players. Even though I could have, I my dad's friend wanted a, uh, well, because they uh, fielder for Kinsler. He lives in uh, Texas, around there, like Dallas or something. He uh, he he said he would uh, trade my my signed Prince Fielder helmet that I got when he came to Detroit uh, for an Ian Kinsler broken bat that he caught in the stands, and that's a pretty easy trade. But I can always put it on eBay or something. But I pr I might I might not. But yeah, and. Uh, so it's pretty nice out. I think I was just doing that because we were waiting to go out to dinner. I have no idea where we were going. But yeah, so uh, I'll be back when we we're like messing. Prob I might be messing around at the restaurant. I mess around everywhere. And yeah, I don't know where we're going, but it'll probably be good. I'm putting my iPad down the drain. If I drop it right now, I have to go all the way downstairs and I'll just still be recording. I have to edit a lot out. We're actually back now in the family room. I said we were going to be out to dinner. I lied to you guys again. Not on purpose. I'm watching Tigers live. Getting ready for the Tigers game to come on. And they're playing the Rays like I said. You guys, if you're a Tigers fan, you are. You probably already knew that. We're at Red Dawn. It's so loud because that speaker. And it's the mighty midget. Red Dawn. That is so loud. I don't even know if you can hear me. right on the water on a dock literally that's why it's called the red dock and i thought it was perfect time to start again because the music just ended and now it comes straight back on it's really really nice it's awesome red dock there isn't that many people here so the food will, shouldn't take that long hot dogs need to leave it was really good now I'm sitting on this bench looking in the water. It was so good. Those hot dogs I ate were really good. The view. Fine trucking. No, I don't want to. <clears throat> now we're leaving. It was really good. Whoa, whoa. I want to see in here. There's nothing in there. Whoa, that's cool. They made a chair out of these. That's really cool. We're on the water. We're walking straight ahead by the boats. <clears throat> Whoa. I, w I thought that was just gonna, gonna like, uh, like snap. I'd have to run so fast. Here's, there, it, the water's really nice. And that's uh, the Shaka uh, surf shop where we went to rent the kayaks. We slid off this ramp right right here we slid off that ramp and my cousin my cousin's phone well she dropped her phone and she had to jump in so she got all wet shaka uh um surf cool there's some there's some ducks over there a boat and yeah it's awesome look at all these okay i won't i won't get too close there's a lot of them they're gonna attack me. Were you kidding? Were you kidding? Their whole family. You're not gonna go under there, no. The water on the train ferry. There's like three left in the world, I think. We haven't moved yet, but we're gonna. There's the, yeah, like the, they uh, spin it around, the chain moves, that's really cool. We're watching the Tigers now, they're losing, of course, 4-1, to one, but V-Mart's about to hit a three-run shot. Nope. Or you, <laughs> or you can just hit it to the first baseman. Good job, Victor Martinez. We love you. 
guys, we're back, and now we're losing 10-1 to 1 in, the, in the top of the ninth. That's terrible. And now I just, uh, well, now they just said that the Tigers are now going into fourth place in the Central, which, uh, that's terrible. But I'm going to end it here. It's pretty late. It's like 1030 maybe. I don't even know. So, yeah, that's it for uh, day four, I think, of the Sagatuck, uh trip. And everything is awesome. I Even the Tigers losing 10-1 to against the Rays. Bye.